I suddenly lost all sensation in my legs from my ribs actually to my toes. I was released with from the hospital after those 30 hours with a new diagnosis and I was given referrals to neurologists who could help me get started with a treatment plan. What I found was after dozens of phone calls that the best chance I had at an appointment with a specialist who could help me was eight months away. Although I was unable to feel the ground underneath me for a very long time, I continued to actively coach junior jazz. I ran a, this small library. I mentored youth in my community. I continued to be a mother to these children and work full time and maintained other volunteer work that was meaningful to me. Um, I kept my regular life in check. Um, even though I did that, I felt alone. I felt unformed, I felt unprepared for what could happen next. So quickly my questions start to, started to become how can I make the best of this next eight months while I'm waiting? What am I doing that can make things better? And what should I stop doing that will make things worse? Um, each flare comes with a new set of symptoms and so each flare comes with a new challenge to figure out how to live my normal life inside of those symptoms however long they decide to stay.